Okay, I'm going to show some of the progress we've made in IE9 Platform Preview Update. I'm going to go through a few demos that are out on the IE9 Test Drive site. I'm running on a mid-range laptop uh, computer from Dell. I'll open the first demo here. This is a demo where we show some text scrolling across the page. There's an SVG star field in the back. You can see the stars flickering. The text is scrolling across the page really smoothly. Um, looks great. And this shows the work that we're doing on top of DirectX and Direct2D uh, with text uh, rendering. Let's look at this demo in another browser. I'm going to open the same demo in Firefox and get the text scrolling. And as the text scrolls across the page here, you'll see it's, it's scrolling a little bit slower. You're getting less smooth rendering of the text. It's a little chunky as it comes into place. So a pretty big difference uh, between uh, this and IE9. Let's look at another demo. Going back to IE9, this is a demo called Browser Flip, where we have these tiles on the page, and as you hover over them, they flip over and show an icon uh, for a browser. And so you see that the images are uh, animating really quickly. Keeping up with me is about 60 frames per second. It's a fun game. You can kind of flip them over and, and, and track along with your mouse. Let's look at this in another browser. I'm going to open that same demo in Chrome. And you'll see as I hover the mouse around that um, the animation is quite a bit slower. And we're getting about six or seven frames per second and it's having a hard time keeping up with the mouse as I move it around. So a pretty big difference between uh, what you see in IE9 where we're rendering through the, the GPU and hardware acceleration. Let's take a look at the third demo. In this demo, we interact with the Flickr photo service and we're bringing images in from the server and you see they fly into place really nicely. As I move my mouse around, you get a little bounce effect on the images. If I click on one, it comes into place. I can click in further and zoom it around. As I move from image to image, I get a nice smooth scrolling effect. It's a really fun uh, way to look at your pictures. Let's look at this um, in another browser. Opening the same demo here in Chrome, we'll see the images start to fly into place. And the whole thing is happening quite a bit slower. We're down to a low frame rate of about five or six frames per second. The animation is happening uh, quite a bit slower. So a pretty big difference. And again, this is really where you see uh, the difference between building on top of the hardware versus doing the software, the rendering in software. So here it is again in IE9, much smoother and faster. So you can try these demos out for yourself on the IE9 test drive site uh, and check out uh, IE9 preview update.